time for 12 o'clock. Welcome. It is uh, Larson Jojo. It is time for the Spilly and Deck show. Well, at first they came and they said, uh, "You would you like to host your own show? You and you and Spilly. And it would be called the uh, Spilly and Deck show. And I was like, nah, I don't think I could do that. It's going to have to be the Dex and Spilly show. At the beginning of the year, I said, Dexy, I'm hitting higher than you. It's my show. He goes, all right, then that's the bet. It's like who's ever hitting higher is a beast the name of the show will be reversed. Uh, Paul, you're up next with uh, Dexas Philly here, live from Jackson's. What's up, Paul? I have never seen anything like your Sunday record the last 19 Sundays in a row. I mean, it's crazy. It is incredible. Though. It is incredible. I've, I've, I've never been a part of anything like that. I mean, we, like we, win, we win half of those. You're one game under 500. It's been a really quiet clubhouse over the last couple of months, hasn't it's it? It's been a little morbid. Ours is a little different in that, you know, you have two major league players talking about baseball in real time with guys that are actually on the team. So, you know, when we have a losing streak, we come in here and we, what's going on in the clubhouse? You get to hear it from us. Especially when the, you guys couldn't turn the music on. Yeah. Oh, that well, was a very I mean, awkward thing to walk hey. in there and not hear it all bumping and banging and you guys all kind of doing this as you're at your locker. No, no, no. Giambi, you weren't there. Giambi in, in St. Louis, when we got the music turned back on, he, he said he went into Trace's office. He was like, can we come out of jail yet? I mean, his his music choice is the same every day. It's Madonna. Yeah, you know, like, no. Yeah. What? And it also gives Dexter and I a chance to be creative and say, look, we really want to talk about this. You want to give the people, you know, the, your, your true feeling. We'll say, hey, make sure you talk about uh, Jack Hanrahan, because that was something that we wanted to get across today. As, as being something special about baseball. The guy's passed the hat. Yeah, he, he, well, he was getting get, his wife is his pregnant. His wife is pregnant and he was gonna Third. miss the birth of his child right. unless he flew private. He couldn't get a commercial flight to get him uh, out of town in time to see the birth of his child. Right, and the child was premature a couple months. So it was, it was oh, like wow. an emergency type thing. He was like, well, we can't afford it. Jack can't afford it. He makes, you know, he doesn't make as much as everyone else. The Dex and Spilly show, I would say would be like a pulpery of sports talk you know i just like talking i like talking to people and and just being in in the light and having fun and, and they said we could talk about anything we wanted and you know who, who's who's a better co-host than, than than spilly the biggest thing that i've learned since i've started doing this media stuff is you really do have to have a filter you have to be able to weigh what's proper and what's unproper what do you want to say that uh, gives people insight into your clubhouse without giving away the the sanctity of the clubhouse. So it, no, it's, it's it's a lot of fun going out and, and talking to people and being able to interact with fans. As a baseball player, we're as much of a fan of everyone else as a regular fan is, and it's our job. We love it. Players trust, care, act, inspire.